Hey guys, what's going on? DreamReaver23 here, and uh, today we're going to be starting a new series on Minecraft. I let some of you guys know about this uh, last week, or I let you guys know about this last week. If you saw the video where I was doing the, uh, just uh, walking around in front of my uh, day job, uh, the game that we were playing is Terra Firma Craft. It's a mod for Minecraft that's actually been out for a few years, and I remember playing it when it was first, first coming out, but it was still um, in its infancy with the... With the development for the mod and everything like that. They've come a long way up to this point, and so I wanted to check it out, and uh, it's it's nice because it's actually gotten me back interested into the game. We're gonna do this to where it's it's seasonal based, so I'll try, I think with the first season, I think I'm gonna try to get uh, around 30 seasons, or episodes for the first season, and uh, I think we'll probably try to take it towards a, more of a learning experience of trying to figure out all the different stuff with the game and how to learn it and everything like that. So I hope that you guys enjoy the series and uh, join me along this journey, and we will see how everything goes uh, along it. So let me go ahead and get the start game started up. Now I am going to pause the video um, while I switch over because it's, it takes a lot of resources when it's first developing the chunk, the world. So we will get that started up there, and I will see you on the other side. All right, and we are back. Uh, I actually had to allocate more memory to the game because whenever it's loading in like this, it takes quite a chunk of memory, so, and I forgot to make any changes to it. So I had to allocate some more memory, and uh, we are all good from there. What is this? have a plant. What are you? Seaweed. It's a vegetable. Salty. Not salty, not savory, not bitter. Alright, cool. So, like I was saying before, this game does run quite a bit different uh, in the fact that there's no easy crafting, there's no uh, easy anything really. It's all quite a bit different. Definitely a rock. Okay. What are the achievements on here? I just hit Y like I'm in Diablo. Getting wood. Benchmarking. Okay, so... Seems like they're pretty similar. Uh, some of the big differences in this game are things like gravity and... Um, how gravity only in, in traditional Minecraft affects regular blocks, right? Uh, or sand, gravel... Uh, those are your main blocks that are affected. That is obsidian right there at the surface. That is crazy. Uh, in this game, it also affects dirt and cobblestone because you have to have all of those things, uh, structures to support all of those those things. And so, I mean, it makes it to where it's quite a bit different to the traditional Minecraft physics, which so many people are like, yeah, Minecraft physics, you know, that's just kind of a, a running joke because dirt, just gravel, just, you know, it just stays up in the air. It's not a big deal. Now this is uh, fresh water, and you can tell it's fresh water because it's got the cat cattails on there. So you can see we can drink if we open-handedly uh, right-click on there. We can actually just drink the water. Now there is a quite a bit of lava here. What is this? No stone unturned. Small bismuth bismuthonite. Units 10. What the hell is that? I don't even know what that is. Gatherer. Okay, we just got uh, some onion seeds. Sweet. We will plant these onion seeds. Now the top bar I know is hunger. The bottom one is thirst. Now I know we don't want to have uh, too much of these because your resources don't regenerate. Holy crap. Okay, so shift still works as a valid form of uh, not falling off of edges, which is always a good thing. You definitely don't want to have, uh, you know, the edges coming up and you falling off of them because that would be bad. Now, I know that we want to stack, collect pretty much like about a stack of, of rocks. I, I've, I've read through the wiki and you actually have a couple different ages, right? So you start off in the, in the stone age and uh, you're not in the metal age until you progress to the point to where you can uh, make some metal so you can do some smelting. Uh, there's a lot of different things that you have to do such as uh, collecting clay so that you can actually form kilns and collecting rocks so that you can make a nap and then uh, K-N-A-P, not N-A-P, not a siesta. 
Uh, that will allow you to um, form, what is that? Small tetrahedrite. Cool. We're going to grab these because I don't know what they do. Uh, the naps will allow you to make things like weapons and, and, and uh, tools such as hatchets uh, or hammers and, and axes and stuff like that. So let's see if what we can do with these tetrahedrites. I'm going to be going back and forth between this, uh, you know, just chatting with you guys and then also making sure I'm following along with the wiki as well because that is something that you, you know, definitely want to do. What are you? So, give me one second, guys. Alright, I am back. See, that was instantaneous for you guys. The wife was, uh, passing on a message to me. I love the message. What is that? A hot springs? But I don't know what hot springs do. <laughs> I don't know! Okay. So much to learn, so much to learn. Look at this, more hot springs. Natural hot springs. I'll be darned. Now, you do have a chance uh, on breaking leaves to get rocks, which are not rocks, sticks. <laughs> Alright, we are thirsty. We do have the onions. Onion seeds. So, we did get some onions. I think we just have to use this to eat. Ooh. Alright. So, that quenches our thirst. Get some sticks. And once again, we don't want to uh, tear off too much of the vegetation around and everything like that because we want it to. Stuff's not replaceable. So, um, animals, breeding animals like cows and horses and sheep and pigs and stuff like that, there's only a set amount of them that form in a, in a landmass chunk. So that's something to think about. Oh, wait, that's a marble rock. That's different. Oh, I guess all these are marble rocks. <laughs> okay. And uh, so we have plenty of onions. Let's keep these up here. Let's see if you hit D, no, S. It puts it into one bigger onion. Yeah, okay. So if you hit S, it, like, combines food. I don't know. It's crazy. All right, now we are going to have to find shelter and uh, possibly some more sticks. I do want to, uh, what are you? That is stone. These hot springs are nice. I, I kind of want to get into them, but I'm, I'm, I'm like, is it going to burn me? It's not going to burn me, so that's nice. I wonder if that'll allow me to stay warm in the winter or something like that. I'm not. I'm not sure. So, um, I do know that we need to find some sort of shelter. Also, we need to. Let's see. Was it right click with these, and then we can make uh, uh, tools. And there's a few different ones. There is a few different ones. That's all I really remember. I know that most of them are, what is that? Cabbage seeds and cabbage, nice. Definitely want to collect some of these, you know, different, different types of uh, crops. But we don't want to take too much of it because we want to make sure, because if we eat all of our stuff, you have seasons in this game, right? So if I hit E, and I guess I should explain some more of these guidelines. It says calendar. Cur right, currently, it's early summer. The day is Thursday, 1st of June, year 1000. Hour 16, right? So it's 4 o'clock in the afternoon. And you have fruits, vegetables. So these are your um, things that you want, like your cravings or, or, you know, like the stuff that you have to have, right? You have to get a balanced diet. Keeps your health up. Those are horses. Super sweet. Those little lag spikes are ridiculous. Oh, that is an enemy over there. We got some rotten flesh. Did you drop anything else? I don't 
see anything else. What is this? You are dirt. It's a weird color for dirt. Um, let's see, what's down here? We could actually kind of use this place as a shelter, as a makeshift so Oh crap, that horse scared the crap out of me. We could run this as a makeshift shelter. This is gravel. So let's, let's, uh... First off, let's make a shovel. Alright, I do know how to make that one. Let's, uh, what? Take off. This and this, and that makes a shovel head. Right, and then... I don't want to keep breaking them, but it's it's something like this. That's not it. So your, your nap only, uh, like you used... Oh crap, it's getting dark. You use the nap. Alright, so we got a shovel, right? So we can get some of this dirt out. Our first tool we make is a shovel. So, see, you can see that right there. This is regular dirt breaks and uh, blocks can also fall sideways I remember reading all right we definitely want to uh, get some of this up here see it, it slid sideways so you're gonna have to make this Work with me. Oh, I mean, that means we won't be able to. So wait, it just fit on the dirt. Yep. All right, that didn't work out very well. well how is this one staying? Okay, we did get some flint. So scared. Okay. Since I don't know what to do, I can make a javelin. Alright, so javelin is something like this. This, this. me a javelin head Put this right here and this right here so you can see a huge difference in uh, just how things work with the game can eat some more onion or baby zombie because I don't think I can take on a baby zombie I just I can't do it Okay. Mm. 
Yep, running away. Running away. What are you? No, not a skeleton. He's got leather armor and everything. Okay, okay, okay. All right, we gotta make it. Also, I need this off my inventory so I can put this back down there. Crap, no. Mm -mm. This is gonna hurt. Oh my goodness, it's like Rambo. They can shoot behind him, that's some crap. All right, respawn. Oh my goodness. Okay, oh jeez, oh jeez. I do like the sounds of the frogs, that's cool. We need to go back and collect our stuff, which was somewhere over here. We need to uh, run. Still running. <laughs> Screw you. <laughs> All right, so we definitely need to uh, hide. I think is is the what is what I'm gathering from this, um, because be a kuaz, I am not gonna be able to take those guys out as of yet. Uh, best to run and hide, fear for our lives, cry, and uh, you know, and then and then we'll see what happens. What are you? I just want to know what you are. Oh, there must have been more gravel or something. I don't know. Run! Oh my goodness, there's an Enderman. I don't even want to look at an Enderman. Okay. <laughs> Zombie. Uh, crazy skeleton. More crazy skeletons, dear goodness. Load up train, I need to see where I'm going. Can it be daytime yet? Oh, for the love of me. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, chameleon. I see some horses. That's cool. Hey, skeleton, why don't you shoot, shoot this zombie? He's not your friend. I heard him talking about your mom. So shoot him, not me. Ah, there's a spider over there. I definitely don't want to deal with a spider. Haha! <laughs> Oh wait, are you not going to shoot each other? Dang it! Oh, they shot a horse! They shot a horse! Ah. Run away! Run away faster! What is this? The sand? Lovely. Oh yeah, need to be running away from. Running for my life is what I'm trying to do. What can you do with the reeds? No nothing. Okay. Well, at least we know we can't do anything with the reeds. But I also see that there are no. Mobs out here. Oh nope, I lied. I lied. Totally lied. Stay back over there. I'm gonna stay right here where it's safe ish. I see the Enderman over there. He's looking at me. I see that skeleton over there. He's looking at me too. I see lava down there. That's nice. Or at least a light source. Okay. The sun is coming up. We have survived through the first night. <laughs> it's ridiculous, man. No, don't look over here, skeleton. Nothing over here. You mind your business over there. Looks like you're taking a leak against the wall. I'm just saying, I should report that to somebody. Enderman, go take care of this skeleton over here. Nope. Okay, okay. I'm, I'm, on my, I'm on my own then. I know that we can also have... Uh, a knife. We can make a knife. I do see that. We can also make a fire pit. Which sounds lovely. 
except for the fact that I don't remember how to make the axe head, and if I exit out of full screen mode, it's gonna mess it up, mess up the recording, so, you know, it's all that. It's all that. Hmm. It's weird that the water doesn't fall. Just saying. Marble rock. Totally broke my shovel. Do they die? That's the question. The skeleton's right there. That skeleton. Does he burst into flames? If not, I am screwed. Hello, horsey. That's a female horse. How you doing? I think I have to actually make a saddle to do anything with you. Alright, and uh, yeah, yeah, I do not see the skeletons bursting into flames. A little upset by that. I'm a little upset by that fact. So... We pigs are going to see what we can find. What are you? Sand. Okay, sweet. Sand. I don't know if sand's even useful, but sweet. I found something. Definitely a huge difference in, uh, in in the game. Already seeing that. All right, so we got to mark that spot over there for the pigs. A tree. We have to fell the trees. We actually have to knock them down completely. What are you? You are sugarcane seeds. All right. Whew. So. Um, I see fresh water over here, and I am hungry, so uh, let's go ahead and finish up this one. We'll try to keep these videos to around 22 minutes, you know what I mean? 22, we'll say 22 to 25. Uh, that way they're not too long, you can kind of get them in on there on a, on a, dang it, on a lunch break, something like that, and uh, take this rotten flesh off. And, and, and we can kind of keep it along those lines. It also makes it to where pretty much you can get through a day. Onion, eat the onion, eat the onion. What is this? Just a flower. A sweet. Butterfly milkweed. Awesome. So, uh, yeah, let me, go, let, me, let, me, let me know what you guys think about the uh, play mode. If you've played Terraformer Craft... Uh, in a previous version and everything like that. Check it out again. Let me know what you guys think uh, down in the comments below. Also, you know, let me know if you guys want to see more of the uh, Minecraft series and everything like that. I'm trying to take it to a different route from what I've done before. And I uh, think with the Terra Firma Craft, it's definitely going to be able to take it in that direction and make it more of a survival game, which uh, for me is a lot more fun. So thank you guys so much for hanging out and joining me. Until next time, guys, I'm DreamReaver23, reminding you to game happy, and I will see you all later. Bye, guys.